So today's result leaves Slough 11th in the National League South table at the end of the season. That doesn't really tell the full story with the 89th minute. We were one goal away. So what's your thoughts at the end of this? Yeah, it was always going to be one of those days where I think things changed every five minutes. And yeah, we know with five minutes to go, we were, uh, I think, a Hemel goal away from getting in the playoffs. And at that point, we'd done our job, which was all we all we wanted to do here today. We can't affect anything else. Um, we're a little bit flat because of the way the game ended for us, obviously, and, and that's seen us drop a few places. Um, which, you know, even at 3-2, I think we were going to finish 8th, ninth, eighth, which you can get a bit hung up on league places. The, the reality is we took our season in terms of playoffs to the last 10 minutes, five, ten, five minutes of the season, which is a, an excellent achievement. Uh, I think we've ended up three points outside the playoffs. So, um, yeah, tinge of disappointment, but, but we just said to the boys in there, they've given us absolutely everything all season. And for a first season at this level, we're, we're proud of what we've achieved. So looking ahead to next season then, is this a great platform to build on? Yeah, I mean, we just said in the change room, to finish 10 games unbeaten, six wins, four draws. Um, should have been seven wins, three draws. Uh, possibly even seven, eight wins, two draws. Um, but you know to, to finish 10 games unbeaten in this league is a big achievement and we just said that's a platform for next season you know we want to we want to improve we want to bring one or two in um, but we've got a nucleus of a brilliant squad most of them committed to us and um, uh, we're, we're already looking forward to next season and uh, yeah, it would have been brilliant, brilliant to have snuck in on the last day in the playoffs, but it wasn't to be. Um, but we we did we did ourselves justice. We did the league justice. Um, you know, commiserations to Truro for for getting relegated, but it's over 42 games and not not over one game. So um, so we we're, we're, we're just delighted with our boys and, and what we've got in there. Uh, would you believe then that playoffs is the objective for next season? I mean, it has to be. Um, we'll be no different to probably 16, 17 other teams that that will be their target. Um, if you finish three points outside the playoffs, absolutely. Of course, each year you look to improve year on year. I think the league will be tougher uh, with some of the teams coming into it. So I think it will be a tougher league. I think we'll be better equipped than we were at the start of this season. So um, we'll just keep, all we can really do is, is, is worry about ourselves. And I think we'll come back stronger. Uh, better squad than we started last season with and um, uh, we're better off for this experience that we've had this year in this league so I've no doubt we'll improve and um, we'll have to see you know we can't affect what other players other clubs bring in and how strong they are but I think it'll be a strong league be a tough league have conversations begun then for players coming in and players staying yeah I mean we're, we're, we're pretty much there aren't we um, you know we've uh, we've got a number of players already committed as I said um, we've already started speaking to a couple um, and uh, uh, you know, we, we, we know we don't need to do loads and loads of the squad. Um, we're we're, uh, we're going to take stock. Obviously, we've got our cup final, hopefully, depending on obviously the, the decision. Uh, it'd be nice to finish on a cup final, but if it's not to be, it's not to be. Um, um, but we'll take stock, but we, we know that we've got a, a really good bunch in there. What they are is they're honest. Um, we're never going to be the biggest players in, in the league and, and, and whatever else, but we, we've got bundles of um, heart, character, um, desire and uh, and some good players in that change room so we're we're looking forward to it and uh, we're, we're looking forward to the break uh, but but we're also looking forward to coming back aren't we yeah yeah not looking forward to buying all these beers so <laughs> <laughs> I think there's uh, I mean the support all, all season's been absolutely incredible um, and and I, I, mean, I don't know what we've got here today but it's great numbers uh, to Truro um, you know so massive hats off to them it's uh, it costs a lot of money to to travel around the country watching them and uh, hopefully that we've given them a lot to shout about this year and uh, or the players have at least and uh, you know we massively appreciate it don't yeah. we yeah so um, finally then what's your message to the fans and hopefully going ahead into the cup final next week well I, I would say go and buy your season tickets um, uh, it's a fantastic deal as per usual um, get behind us you know we want we want to we want to build we want to build Slough Town up. We want to be knocking on the door of a conference national, and and we need we need everyone behind us to do that. And uh, um, but we you know we if, we if we're in the cup final, then you know obviously again get behind us in that game. But um, we a nice we really way to end fun. the season if we can get to that cup final and win it. Um, you know it will be a, a fitting way to end the season. And I say we've it's been a good day today, but a little tinge of disappointment. I think that one more game would be nice. It'd be nice to finish on a real positive. So all right, brilliant. Thank you very.